Hello everyone, welcome to our Let's Play series of Mass Effect. This is Colonel RPG as usual, and I'm very happy that it shows to join me today as I take those colonists out. Uh, not quite... Good, good, good. Not quite as uh, easy to do as I thought, but what I did then... What I did then is I threw a grenade at them and didn't kill them. That's how it works. Uh, yeah, these guys are very different from the the husks that we saw. Th those husks down there look like Geth to me, uh, which would make which would make sense if um, if we're talking about the Geth wanting this quote telepathic unquote creature for them. Uh, these are not people. I mean, I don't know. My God, Rex. It's a good thing they're really tar they're really focused on me. Rex is uh, is actually poisoned because, of course, it is space suit doesn't protect him from environmental hazards. Oh! Enemy is everywhere! Kill you. No, you are not. This was where the other one got killed. Oh, can you please not do that? Thank you. Thank you very much. Oh, husks. Okay. I would rather not be hit by that. I really wish we had a melee attack. It makes so much sense. Okay. Okay, that's good. Okay, that's one. Who's that? That's a colony. Let's move one of the cargo blocks and see what calls out. That's fine by me. So I didn't kill any of them, despite the grenade. The grenade is upgraded on purpose, don't worry. So these are... I will destroy you! Oh, not that line! I hate it. I hate that line. They're throwing up on me. Seriously? The sort of damage throwing up on you is the sort of damage that wearing clothes can protect you from, let alone a freaking spacesuit. Okay. Oh, we got a thing over here. Upgrade kit. Thank you. I don't know what that is for. That is Ledra. Good. We can experience, but they don't die. That leg doesn't... I mean, I think maybe permanent damage has been done, but we, we can disregard that a little bit. So... What are we supposed to think? I think there was a there was a a civil in, a, in there. What are we supposed to think? Are we supposed to think that these are repurposed? I'm using that word on purpose. Uh, repurposed Thorian creeper. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's not his name. That's the. That's just what it is. Um, repurposed members of, of here? Is that There's controls for the crane, Commander. Can you make sense of them? No. I'm very bad at everything. Incoming! Yes! Indeed incoming. Oh, there's there's more of you. That's the uh, Lynette voiced... <laughs> I, I don't know her name. I'm sorry. Uh, that's, I also don't know the name of the character, but I certainly don't know the name of the, uh, the voice actress. Tried to fight it, but it gets in your head. You can't imagine the pain. I was supposed to be their leader. These people trusted me. It wants me to stop you, but I won't. You won't. Don't worry. I won't. Ah. Uh. And of course, Shepard, very frowny there, because she forgot she had a grenade. That's what immediately she should have done, is thrown a grenade at him. But he at least... Where's he? Oh, that's him. He at least did us the favor of definitely not endearing himself to us. He comes across as a jerk at the best of times, so we don't really miss him. Nobody really does. I mean, most of the colonists sort of come across as jerks. Not jerks, I guess, but very weird, and there's definitely something 
fishy. Uh, okay, so where are the controls? Because I can't see them on account of having companions. Wait, are we supposed to shoot them? No, sorry. We we took care of it. I don't know why. Oh, maybe it's, it's underground. That's what the exclamation mark is doing. I don't know what that sound track was for. Okay, but it, it, we're, we're, we're moving. What kind of enemies await us besides the Geth? Well, it's the Thorian. Is it going to be a boss fight? Because I'm going to die if it is going to be a boss fight. We also leveled... Oh! What in the hell is that? Okay. Um... So, y'all need to level up a little bit. Good, good, good. Um, Spectre training, yeah. Uh, I can't level these up many more, so let them be. Actually, let's let's keep that because we're about to probably gain some points, some extra points in things. I see you. Really? You don't die? Man, these scripted events, old school RPGs do it more than the new ones. And this is, I, I'm considering this an old school RPG. I mean, RPGs from more than 10 years ago do it more than, than the ones from less than 10 years ago. Um, and what do they do? They build an, a, a, just a fundamentally rational hatred towards scripted stuff. Like, this guy is scripted not to die. A lot of old school games do it like that, where basically these these scripts are unintuitive because they don't use the normal systems of the game, um, and they don't reward like it would be cool if we could kill him because it would be a reward for staying attentive. A lot of games do this, and this game isn't too bad in this regard actually. Uh, and uh, I remember growing up and and just I say growing up, but like in as as I played more and more RPGs, I would just I would I would rage. <laughs> against scripted stuff, scripted events, because a lot of the old games would break, especially because, like, some scripts would just not be reactive enough, because scripts in, by themselves are not emergent gameplay, they're scripted events. Um, so they wouldn't be reactive enough, they would break because uh, you killed one uh, NPC, or maybe because somebody was aggroed when they shouldn't have been, or maybe because you opened a door that you shouldn't have. Uh, there's there's stuff that breaks so easily with, with scripts, it's unbelievable. Um, but... Um, but more, more as well, because it just, it, it's so clearly a limitation on the storytelling. Because it doesn't allow you to tell a different story other than us coming in here, nonchalantly, doesn't, don't even looking at okay, the thing. we just have to find this thing and put a couple of rounds into... And spotting what it before that? she says that. Yeah, I saw that. We are gonna need bigger guns. The comment that I chose was better. That's large. It's, it's, it's uh, more insightful. We only need the Mako, really. Invaders, your every step is a transgression. A thousand feelers appraise you as meat, good only to dig or decompose. I speak for the old growth as I did for Saren. You are within and before the Thorian. It commands that you be in awe. I can't help but notice that the name of this person that we're talking to is a Sari clone, but she is um, fully clothed right now. Uh, and I, I, so I don't know that the implication here is that she was just cloned right now, uh, in, in, as in, you know, like a, the, the, the Thorian had a database of Asadi and just made her on the spot, which I think is the intention, but I think the, the clothes were also made, uh, and they look really cool, I like, I like the, the clothes, they, they, they're like a rubberized material and it's pretty awesome, anyway, um, yeah, 
You enslaved the colonists. You destroyed their minds. I don't know what Saren wanted with you, but I just want you dead. The Thorian is a piece of this world, extending across the land and back through the ages. You can no more kill it than cut the sky. Your blood will be the ground. I... Okay. That is a boss fight. But there's no ads? Ads as in extra enemies. Oh, hi. It's interesting that they fall over. Uh, Ashley's an idiot. As we know. Was that not doing... Ashley is not needed. Her combat routines are. Uh, was that not doing damage? I can't throw grenades right now. I don't have grenades, I am assuming. Okay. Ashley, I really would like you not to have died. Oh my god. I keep overestimating how, how long it takes to... Uh, cool down this thing. Oh, hi. I think I have a melee attack. Look at that. Oh, this is really cool, actually, that I found out the melee attack. Bunk. I like that a lot. Hi. Bunk. You're not gonna make more, are you? That's just a neural node. Okay, let's uh, let's bring you back. Commander, some sort of growth in here. Check it out. That hurt it. I can tell. A few more of those, and it's in trouble. I think the the growth that she's referring to was that one. Thought there was another one. Oh, there's another one. Hmm. Maybe, maybe it's not that. Okay, let's push forward. Not 100% sure what's going on. This is definitely not a plant. Especially not with nerves. Although, it's not completely un unreasonable to say that plants have nerves. They have similar things. They're feelers. Some of them. I don't know the name of it. Look, it's the fully clothed clone again. I'm not... I, I'm not disappointed that she's not naked. I'm just saying that it's a clone. I mean... Ooh! Where? What? Okay. There's zombies. No, no. It's just that thing. Um, I'm just saying that if she were a clone, then... The, it's, it's complicated. I don't know why she's back, though. I mean, it's not her. I keep forgetting. It's not... She's not back. Over there. It's just more of them. Kunk. Both of them go down. Kunk. Perfect. This is beautiful. Kunk. Oh my god, what are you doing to my shields? Oh hi, she's back. I was trying to shoot and I couldn't. Oh, I didn't notice. You died. That's not what it says. What is that? What's it say? Critic uh, yeah, that's this that did. That is such a weird... That is such a weird thing for the game to say. Critical mission failure when you die. It's like, I remember... Um, can we skip this? Not really. Uh, I remember, I think it's Gothic 3? That um, there's, there's one main quest somewhere that uh, has a... For some reason, that has a... Uh, one of the conditions for failure is that, uh, that you die. If you die... Then you fail. And what happens with that? Oh, that might be the reason why I died a little bit too fast. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. You must die. I did it already. Oh, they're talking. It's fine. Uh, so I think I got hit by the poison. The poison pierces shields. I I have noticed. Um, but um, but in that game, basically, when you die, uh, there's a pop up that says mission failure, <laughs> where. Everywhere else in the game, it doesn't say that. 
but um, but starting from a certain part of the game, or I think it's just one part of the game that says uh, that is really weird. It's one of those games that I definitely have to play on the channel someday. I'll start with Gothic 1, though, and then Gothic 2 and Gothic 3. They're enormous games. I'm trying not to do that again. I hate it. I'm not 100% sure what what it even is that that particular ability is. I need to go down. F, 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 R. God damn it. I was pressing F so hard. Things are not good. Bunk. Oh my god. I mean, I mean I'm gonna be fine. The cooldown on the heels are is a little bit of a problem. The shooting is... But, but... There we go. The shooting is... Oh, look at that. I'm trying to shoot and I can't. It doesn't. I'm not crazy. Um, uh, That's the sound it makes. Don't, don't question me. I'm not crazy. The game is unresponsible a lot of the time. When, it, when you want to shoot... <laughs> you don't say. Uh, when you want to shoot... That was a difficult mission, though. Or a difficult bit. This guy, I don't like him. There we go. So, let's see if first, I'm, it, I, it comes to my, not attention, but the, I wonder if first aid is, is a specific, is a specific uh, um, skill button, like F is. It is. Then how, Come, I only got it then. Maybe it gives us plus one. Yeah, potentially that's that. What? Oh, there's more of them. I should have saved. We're gonna be fine. We're gonna be totally fine. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Is that the strength of the pistol? Because I doubt... Oh. How... I... Uh, the, yeah, the, I think I... Was I attacked from the back? I don't know. Um, I wonder if... Um, no, no. I'm going to need to do that again. Don't worry about it. I was going to say, I wonder if it's only the, the pistols that... Um, that do the, the melee attack. I don't know if it is, but I tried the melee attack against the clone herself, and uh... There it is. And um... It, it, didn't, it didn't work out. Okay. So, let's try this again. Still don't have grenades, although I did get some stuff when I opened the inventory that I didn't do before. Let's be a little bit more aggressive here. The game is freaking out with the sound. Overheating. Yeah, I really need to be very, very careful with the... Uh, with that. Which isn't a problem. Because I just saved. Uh, am I going the wrong way? No, I'm not. So they complain a little bit. This means I got killed so fast, either they were already throwing up, which is perfectly plausible, or I got hit by by a uh, by one of those things that knocked me out. This guy doesn't know what he's doing. Oh, that's bad. Yeah, because the the throwing up on my companions also throws up on me. It's an AoE. My god. Can you please do your job? They do so little damage in comparison to me. Perimeter clear. Uh-huh. Okay. Let's get this. And off we go. For some things. Okay. I like some things. And save. 
There's a neural no, no a neural node. Oh, there you are. They're coming. From back here? No. They're above. Which is interesting. Hmm. Be careful here. There we go. Oh, that's the that's the that's the clone. Oh man, this sucks, and I'm lost. Okay, I'm taking a lot of shield damage. That is a lot of damage that, that, that the clone does. Yeah, look at that. I just need a melee attack again. I think I'm gonna die. Can't believe I didn't, to be honest. The shooting is just stops every once in a while. We got this. You say that, it's me who's who has to be okay. Immortal companions are the best. Okay. Well, in shoot in real time games, they have to be immortal because real time games are inherently unrealistic. Because you know, otherwise you'd just die. You're fighting too many enemies. Unless, of course, you're not fighting too many enemies, in which case they can be realistic. Let's not be there. Another one of the many, many reasons why turn-based games are better. I got killed for that comment. Let's try that again, shall we? Yeah, I mean, I knew I was gonna get hit there. They are... These are not enemies that you fight at close range. And this pistol, or any pistol I assume, is not particularly well suited. this particular type of encounter. Unless, of course, the pistols are indeed the only thing that can that can do melee attacks. Which I believe is, it is not. There we go. They enter a, a certain state of animation when they uh, when they're about to throw up. Let's look, look at our inventory. We keep not getting stuff from here. I'm not sure where we get the things, oh, there it is. I'm not sure when we get the things that uh, show up when we open the inventory. Okay, that's weird. I don't know why you turned your back on me, but sure. And, and when I'm, like, aiming down, uh, it's, uh, I'm gonna die. It's very hard to know what the heck I'm, I'm running up against in the back. And that's why you see me die so often, is, uh, or a lot of the times, it's because I, I just can't, can't fall back fast enough. Because I keep getting hit, uh, stuck on things. Okay. We're making progress. It's a lot of shooting progress. But we are playing on harder difficulty. And I didn't save there. And I probably should have. Um, do I know how to use this? Yes. Click once. Uh, don't have first aid. I think... It's a lot simpler than I thought it was. Okay, I don't know what that guy's gonna do. I'm, I'm mad. I'm out. I think it's a lot sim. Oh my god! What is piercing my shields? Okay. 
Okay. Oh, third person shooters, I tell you. They're smart enough to take cover. That's kind of interesting. Whew. I don't know what was doing me so much damage. I have the shields up. Oh, Ashley, come on. It's two of them. I, I can't shoot. Oh, it didn't give me the peep, 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 peep. There we go. Yeah, the peep, 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 as it turns out, is pretty important. But time is also pretty important because we're out of it. So for right now, I'm Colonel RPG, and this has been Mass Effect. I really hope you've enjoyed it. And if you did, go ahead and leave a comment. Like the video if you want to see the next episode come out sooner rather than later. But above all, thank you so much for watching, and I hope I'll see you next episode. Bye-bye.